Hi there, my name is Spencer. I'm with Deseret First Credit Union. We're here at Deseret Book today, downtown at City Creek. We are going to ask people what they think about their fathers, and uh, in exchange, we're gonna buy them something. So let's go inside. You got shopping for your dad? No. <laughs> I'm just looking. Did you find anything for Father's Day already? Oh man, <laughs> she warned me about this. <laughs> what did she tell you? Uh, she told me that they are interviewing people for Father's Day gifts. Kind of, yeah. We're just uh, out asking people what their thoughts are about their dad. You love your dad? Yes, I do love what's him. Your <laughs> what's your favorite thing about your dad? Um, I don't know. We're just alike. Like We think the same, so it's really easy to get along with him. That's a lovely accent. Where are you from? You're not from Salt Lake. No, I'm not. I'm from Alabama. From Alabama? That's a long way away. Yes. I've never been to Alabama. Oh, really? Is it nice? Oh, I love it. It's wonderful. Which is better, Utah or Alabama? I'm a little biased, so I gotta say Alabama. That's fine, because guess what? I'm not from Utah either. I'm from Washington. Oh, all right. It's better than Utah. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I love Utah. This is just weird to me, so I'm looking around because we don't have places like this. Is this the biggest mall you've ever been to in your life? Um, yeah. <laughs> and it's weird that there's a church store in the middle of it, but it's really great. It's kind of cool, right? Yeah. Okay. Really do. So we're with Deseret First Credit Union. The cre this credit union started over in the church office building over 50 years ago. And today the credit union serves members of the LDS Church. And so we're here at Deseret Book, also affiliated a little bit with the church, right? Yeah, just and uh, asking people about their thoughts on Father's Day. Uh, what's the best piece of advice your dad ever gave you? Oh man, um, I don't know. He's, he's a very good spiritual man. He used to be the bishop, so he's given me a lot of church advice. It's really helped me. Well, you worked for this video too. We'd like to buy you something. Can we buy you something? Looks like you already bought something, but but was there something else you wanted and you're like, well, I don't have the money to buy that because you're a responsible I'm spender. I'm sure I can find something. Yeah. <laughs> You'll find something and you find us and we'll buy it for you. All right, thank All right. you. Thank Happy you. Father's Day to your dad. What's your dad's name? Tom. Tom. Happy Father's Day, Tom. Happy Father's Day, Daddy. <laughs> Mind if we ask you a couple questions about Father's Day? Is this your son? Yes, it is. What's your son's name? Isaac. Isaac. Is this your dad? Yeah? What do you think about your dad? Is he pretty cool? Just shake your head. That, that means yes. And uh, what are you getting for Father's Day? What do you think you're getting? Uh, probably a battery for my drill. A battery for your drill? Is it like a, as a power big drill? Like a DeWald? Yeah, pretty cool. Are you going to build something? Uh, work on my deck. Work on your deck. That's a good summer activity. What about your dad? Have you got anything for him? Well, we got him a nice card and we took him out to dinner. So you've already, you've already covered Father's Day. Did you spend more on your father for Father's Day than you spent on your mother for Mother's Day? No. No. Who's easier to shop for? Mom, definitely. Mom is easier and she gets more spent on her. Okay, very cool. And uh, any other kids that you have? Yeah, this is it. This is it. And uh, besides the drill, what are you guys going to do for Father's Day? I don't know. Go to church, right? Go to church. Are you going to sing to your dad on Sunday? You are? Are you going to sing a song called I'm So Glad When Daddy Comes Home? Well, that's great. We're just with Deseret First Credit Union. We're out talking to people about their dads, and uh, we'd really like to buy you something for Father's Day. Would that be all right? For sure. Is there anything you already saw that you want, or was there something that you saw that you didn't maybe have an extra, extra money for? What do you think? Was there something that you wanted, buddy? We'll get you both something. Did you see something that you wanted here at the store? Hmm? Did you see any? You did? What did you, what did you see that you wanted? Um, I did want some books. You want some books? Mm-hmm. Yeah. What book do you want? Um, so a train one. A train book. Um, did we find one? Should we go look for one? All right, come show us where the train book is. Trains. All right. Very cool. Let's see that train. All right. You like trains? Yeah. You want your dad to take you on a train? You want your dad to buy you a train? How about just a train book? Okay. Good. All right. Is that okay, Dad? Guess what? Dad's not going to buy it. We're going to buy it. Can I go buy it for you? Can you say thank you? Let's go buy it. What's your favorite thing about your dad? He is really hardworking, and he likes to have a good time with his family. Um, well, he's just so open and willing to do anything for anyone. I like that my dad is not afraid to act like a teenager. Uh, he works hard. <laughs> he 
taught me how important service is. How did he do that? He, my dad's not a member, but he serves a lot of people in my community and a lot of families. And so. That's great. What does he do to serve? Um, he has a farm and he grows his own crops, so he feeds the families who are in need. He is the most giving person you will ever meet. Is there anything that you want to tell your dad for Father's Day? Thank you so much for being there and inspiring me to do all the things that I'm doing today. Thanks for always being there for me. <laughs> Hi, can we ask you some questions about Father's Day and fathers? Oh, of course. Of course. Is this your husband here? This is my husband. And is he a father? He is a father. What kind of a father is he? He's a fabulous father. He's kind and gentle and he apologizes. He apologizes. Yes, if he does something, raises his voice or does something that to the kids and then he feels bad, he'll go and apologize. Is that true? That's what I hear. <laughs> I love you. I miss you. You're great. <laughs> Just I love you and you are a really good example for me and support for me. Great. I'm so glad when daddy comes home, glad as I can be. Got my hands to shop for joy. And climb up on his knee. Put my arms around his neck. Hug him tight like this. Pat his cheeks and give him what? A great big kiss. <laughs> big thank you to Deseret Book today for having us down. It was fun talking to people about their dads. Be on the lookout for us as we uh, may be surprising you and buying you something soon. <laughs>